It's now time for the Mike Wagner Show, powered by Sonic Web Studios. Visit online at sonicwebstudios.com for all your needs. The Mike Wagner Show can be heard on Spreaker, Spotify, iHeartRadio, YouTube, iTunes, Anchor FM, Radio Public, and themikewagnershow.com. Mike brings you great guests and interesting people from all across the globe. So sit back, relax, and enjoy another great episode of the Mike Wagner Show. Hey everybody, it's Mike from the Mike Wagner Show. Powered by Sonic Web Studios. Visit online at sonicwebstudios.com for all your needs. Look at a professional website without breaking your budget. Sonic Web Studios is the answer. Sonic Web Studios offers fast, affordable custom web designs that blow the competition away. Call today at 1-800-303-3960. That's 1-800-303-3960. Or email to support at sonicwebstudios.com. Mention the Mike Wagner Show. Get 10% off your first order. Sonic Web Studios. Take your image to the next level. Also, the Mike Wagner Show can be heard on the MikeWagnerShow.com. You can check our Facebook page at Facebook.com slash the Mike Wagner Show. You can download and listen on Facebook, SoundCloud, Spreaker, Spotify, and iHeartRadio. Also on Anchor FM, Radio Public, iTunes, Google Play, Apple, and over 35 podcast platforms for the Mike Widener Show. Take the Mike Widener Show with you on any mobile device. Subscribe to the Mike Widener Show on the YouTube channel. Also follow the Mike Widener Show on Instagram and Twitter today. We're here with the uh, next happening hip-hop artist from Nashville, Tennessee. He is um, best known as 2-4. He's got a new song called Party Time. He's um Huge sports fan in Nashville, Tennessee. He's looking to make his mark. Hip hop, R and B, gritty old school, a lot more. And this guy's just driving force, and he's about to rock Nashville and all over the United States and the world. He's got the hip party time out there. And live, ladies and gentlemen, from the music city where he's having his own party time, ladies and gentlemen, DeAndre Davis of Two Four. DeAndre, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Thanks for joining us today, Two Four. Thank you for having me. I appreciate it. Hey, no problem. So you've been in Nashville, Tennessee for quite some time. You got a new song called Party Time, and um, you basically um, just combine gritty old school, rap, modern hip-hop, R&B, and um, you have a very, very interesting style. And, of course, you've got, um, you know, just a lot of great stuff coming up. And before we get into all that, uh, tell us how I got started music-wise. Well, I mean, it, I've really always been into music, um, but when I was growing up, I was mostly uh, just a sports guy. You know, I played a lot of sports and stuff like that. And um, so, I mean, it just got to the point to where, like, my parents would have me listening to, like, everything, especially my dad. He would have me listening to, you know, old R&B and pop, rock, everything. I was listening to everything growing up. So, it, I, you know, I, I kind of started writing, got into writing and um you know, it had just kind of blossomed from there. So, um, and now, I, you know, that's all I do is write and uh, listen to music and, you know, things like that. So, really, I'm not doing too much different from what I was doing when I was doing mm -hmm. And what was that one moment that influenced you into writing and uh, doing some hip-hop precisely? Well, I mean, I, when I was always writing, I, I was never really writing uh genre specific i was just writing what i thought sounded good to whatever i was hearing at the time and uh it just kind of grew into that um and as far as like the aha moment um, i was actually uh I, I was already writing all the way through school and things like that but there's actually two moments actually but in high school um i pretty much entered a poetry contest my english teacher was pushing me to you know, in their contest, and it was like school wide and all of this stuff. And all I really did was write a verse. I just, I was like, okay, you know, I'll do it, I guess. And I just wrote 16 bars and it won the whole thing, and I got put in the paper and all that stuff. And so that was one moment where it was like, oh, well, I guess, you know, I might be actually pretty good at this. And then I had a football scholarship actually in college, and uh, I was always writing, and that was always what I wanted to do. And so I put football to the side and I started doing music, you know, fully, fully at that moment. And now, you know, seven, eight years later, I'm still here doing what I love to do. Interesting. Where did you play uh, football at or, or what college? Uh, it was uh, Bethel University. It's a small school in, uh, here in Tennessee. Uh, yeah, but I play, I play sports all the way from, I mean, I play virtually 
football, basketball, baseball. I ran track. I played lacrosse for a little while. I, you know, I dabbled in all the other sports. So from the time I was able to pick up a bat, ball, anything like that, I've been playing. So. Oh, that's fantastic. I saw you play for the Tennessee Titans and uh, do some hip hop. I can imagine that. <laughs> and, and who are some of your favorite artists, singers, and uh, musicians growing up? Um, I mean, really everybody. I really didn't have like too many uh, favorites because I was too busy kind of writing my own stuff. But I mean, as far as like, I have like a bunch of influences and a bunch of different genres and stuff. But um, as far as like rap and hip hop specifically, um, Lil Wayne, Jay Z, uh, Lupe Fiasco, Ludacris, people like that that you know I kind of gravitated towards and listened to, and then you know just kind of grew. As you know, I learned different genres and you know started hearing different sounds that I had never heard before and stuff like that. So um, my genres and uh, you know influences range pretty wide. Mm-hmm. It, it sounds like you're doing pretty good as well, too. We'll play um, one of your tracks from your abstract uh, EP called Party Time. But first, listen to the Mike Wagner Show at the themikewagnershow.com, powered by Sonic Web Studios. Visit online at sonicwebstudios.com for all your needs. Look at a professional website without breaking your budget. Sonic Web Studios is the answer. Sonic Web Studios offers fast, affordable custom web designs that blow the competition away. Call today at 1-800-303-3960. That's 1-800-303-3960 or email to support at sonicwebstudios.com. Mention the Mike Wagner Show. Get 10% off your first order. Sonic Web Studios. Take your image to the next level. Also, the Mike Wagner Show can be heard on the themikewagnershow.com. You can check our Facebook page at facebook.com slash themikewagnershow. You can download and listen on Facebook, SoundCloud, Spreaker, Spotify, and iHeartRadio. Also on Anchor FM, Radio Public, iTunes, Google Play, Apple, and more. In over 35 podcast platforms, you can catch the Mike Wagner Show. Also, take the Mike Wagner Show with you on any mobile device and subscribe to the Mike Wagner Show on the YouTube channel. Follow the Mike Wagner Show on Instagram and Twitter today. We're here with DeAndre Davis, best known as 2-4 here on the Mike Wagner Show from Nashville, Tennessee. He's got the new uh, EP I'll call Abstract, but right now, here's one of the singles that's burning up on YouTube and Spotify and the other charts. Here's Party Time from 2-4 on the Mike Wagner Show. Like, hold up, Mr. Light Switch, we in this bitch Acting like a fool and we breaking all the rules And we all the way turn like we mixing all the booze Living life full of color, giving all the haters blues This a favorite song, baby, trying to twerk in the Jimmy Choo's If she throwing hints, I'ma follow all the clues Tell the people on the side that ain't dancing, take a L It's a motherfucking party, middle fingers in the air Like you don't get in the club and they know I got jobs Dollars. Man, these haters trying to start shit, but we don't want problems, and we already lit, but we trying to get higher, we got all the cameras flashing, we rocking designer, you fucking with a beast, no you don't want to try them, see the baddest in the club, and you know that I got her, and we ain't going home, we gon' go to the morning, we about to get down, got the dance floor roaring, nigga, got the party rocking in the face, making love to the snap, and I got the Squad with me, anybody wanna dare? Got that Bon Jovi swagger like we living on a prayer. And we got a bunch of bottles, but we never wanna share. And we all feel like rock stars, the whole club is VIP. And it's getting hot in here like everyone on ecstasy. Trying to end the night like my tumbo got a block. It takes some money out your pocket, ladies, pop a lock and drop it. Up. And they know I got dollars, man. These haters trying to start shit, but we don't want problems. And we already lit, but we trying to get higher. We got all the cameras flashing, we rocking designer. You fucking with a beast, no, you don't wanna try them. See the baddest in the club, and you know that I got her. And we ain't going home, we gon' go to the morning. We about 
about to get down Got the dance floor roaring, nigga, hawk in the club And they know I got dollars, man, these haters trying to start shit But we don't want problems, and we already lit But we trying to get higher, we got all the cameras flashing We rocking designer, you fucking with a bitch No, you don't wanna try them, see the baddest in the club And you know that I got her, and we ain't going home We gon' go to the morning, we about to get and that's party time from 2 4 here on the Mike Wagner Show. And uh, I guess it's so good to want to start up again, but I'm not going to lie to here. So tell us more about that song and uh, what inspired you to write it. Um, it, it really just kind of came kind of naturally, really. I mean, I went out, uh, you know, and, and I love the hit of city downtown Nashville. And I, you know, was just kind of hanging out. And, uh, getting drinks and stuff and usually when I go out I'm usually listening for you know something that I can catch a vibe to for you know my own you know writing and things like that but uh, I just kind of got in from a night out and uh, you know just I started listening to beats and it just kind of came to me I wrote that song actually in, in about 20-30 minutes so that song really kind of came up pretty quick and I kind of knocked it out pretty quick <laughs> it sounds like you're pretty good at it too. 20 minutes is just a phenomenal time. And you also have um, other tunes from your app sack release, We Up, Waves, Take My Time, Night to Remember. And uh, tell us more about those songs and what inspired you to write them. Um, you know, uh, a lot of the stuff that I write about is, you know, stuff that either I've experienced or, uh, you know, things that I know that other people have experienced or maybe I'm, you know, might be talking about somebody specific or maybe I'm just being general. I mean, it really just kind of depends. I kind of like to write about things that I know and I see. And, um, you know, all of those songs are um, kind of just a, you know, kind of a mixture of that. Mm -hmm. and, and also, what do you base your lyrics on as well, too? Like, say, with your, your life or, say, uh, with experience, music, anything like that? Um, uh, it, it really just, uh, it's kind of hard to explain. I don't necessarily know really like, you know, I'll hear, I'll hear, a, I'll hear a, uh, you know, a beat or something like that. And it, it really just kind of starts flowing. It, it's really kind of like not of a, it's not like really a, I mean, it's a process, but it's not really like something where I'm just like, okay, I have to do A, B, and C in order to get, you know, to where I want to get to. It's just more of a, I hear it and then, words to start coming and uh and depending on what the vibe that i'm feeling at the time or uh depending on what i'm actually doing at the time because most of the time when i'm writing it's not like just sitting down with a pen and pad writing it's mostly i'm mostly writing on my iphone when i'm you know walking around town or i'm you know going to a restaurant or anything i'm, I'm virtually writing at all times so the lyrics kind of come from really what i see at the time or what i'm doing at the time or how I'm feeling at the time. Mm -hmm. And that's amazing as well, too. We'll talk about what's coming up in 2020 and future plans for more. You listen to The Mike Wagner Show at themikewagnershow.com, powered by Sonic Web Studios. Visit online at sonicwebstudios.com for all your needs. Look at a professional website without breaking our budget. Sonic Web Studios is the answer. Sonic Web Studios offers fast, affordable custom web designs that blow the competition away. Call today at 1-800-303-3960. That's 1-800-303-3960. Or email to support at sonicwebstudios.com. Mention the Mike Wagner Show. Get 10% off your first order. Sonic Web Studios. Take your image to the next level. Also, the Mike Wagner Show can be heard on the themikewagnershow.com. You can check our Facebook page at facebook.com slash themikewagnershow. You can download and listen on Facebook, SoundCloud, Spreaker, Spotify, and iHeartRadio. Also on Anchor FM, Radio Public, iTunes, Google Play, Apple, and more. Take the Mike Wagner Show with you on any mobile device. Subscribe to the Mike Wagner Show on the YouTube channel. Also follow the Mike Wagner Show on Instagram and Twitter today. We're here with um, DeAndre Davis from 2-4 here on the Mike Wagner Show, based out of Nashville, Tennessee. We just heard party time from the latest uh, EP release abstract here on the Mike Wagner Show. And what do you have coming up in terms of 2020 when it comes to um, any new material, new EPs, and more? Uh, well, actually, my new, I'll have a, my, this is kind of the first time that I'm actually mentioning this because I just came up with the date, but um my next single will actually be out May 15th. It's called Light Show. And um, 
So that's the, the latest and greatest that'll be coming here fairly soon. Um, and as far as, you know, kind of projecting future into 2020, I'll be doing definitely be releasing more singles. Um, you know, just trying to get more music out there, uh, you know, kind of building my base and, uh, you know, talking to people and building fans, and, you know, just kind of everything that goes along with that. So uh, definitely a lot of new material coming. Uh, and, you know, so stay tuned for all of that. But May 15th is the, is the next wave of, you know, 2-4. That sounds fantastic. We're looking forward to it. And um, what, what do you, who do you consider your biggest influence in your career? Uh, my biggest influence? Um, I, I mean, I would just say, you know, just how I was raised and, you know, just being the man that I am today and, you know, how that kind of influences everything that I do. And so I would say just how I was raised by my parents and stuff like that is, you know, the biggest thing that, you know, has brought me to where I'm at today. Mm -hmm. That's fantastic. What's the best advice you can give to anybody at this point? Uh, I would say if music is, or, you know, in anything in general, but just music specifically, if that's something that you really want to do and you really love to do it, um, don't stop until you get to where you want to get to. Um, but businesses and stuff like this have a funny way of weeding people out that don't really care uh, and don't really love it. So uh, if, if you, you know, whatever it is, if you love it, and that's what you want to do. Don't let nobody stop you from getting to where you want to get to. Mm -hmm. And that's a fantastic uh, best piece of advice. And once again, DeAndre, a big thank you for your time. You've been fantastic. Looking forward to having you again soon. DeAndre Davis from 2-4 here on the Mike Wagner Show with his um, new song, Party Time. And once again, tell us about your upcoming projects, what's your website, how do people contact you, and where can people purchase or listen to your music? Uh, so uh, as far as all my socials, uh, Instagram and Twitter, you can uh, hit me at 24 World. It's the number two, four spelled out, World is all, all one word. Um, I have a website. It's www.thereal24.net. Um, and that has, you know, that's links to all of, you know, if I have shows coming up, if, uh, if you need the links to where all my music actually is, it's all on the website and things like that. Um, and as far as where you can find my music, you can find it wherever you, listen to your music so i'm all over spotify and uh apple music and uh, amazon where, wherever you get your music from i'm there so you should be able to find me but uh two four if, if you're looking for me just in general just type in the number two four spelled out and i usually come up sounds great thank you very much uh two four you've been fantastic looking forward to having you again soon do us a favor keep this up to date looking forward to having you again soon in 2020 and beyond and you've been fantastic Oh, well, you know, I'll, I'll definitely keep you in the loop, but I appreciate you having me on. My Thanks for listening to The Mike Wagner Show, powered by Sonic Web Studios. Visit online at sonicwebstudios.com for all your needs. The Mike Wagner Show can be heard on Spreaker, Spotify, iHeartRadio, iTunes, YouTube, Anchor FM, Radio Public, and themikewagnershow.com. Please support our program with your donations at themikewagnershow.com. Join us again next time for another great episode of The Mike Wagner Show.